guys oh god you guys i'm just gonna show you guys my new hair <laughs> yes a moment of silence for this beauty that has come your way today <laughs> hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm aya bimbola and this is oin said so <laughs> I'm so happy today, people have no idea. Like, I'm so excited that I finally made my hair. Like, I've not made my hair, like, made my hair in such a long time. I'm so excited. Can you guys see, like, the transformation? I just look like a babe, like, a babe. <laughs> oh, gosh, I played so much. Welcome back to the channel, guys. And if you're not subscribed yet, please, what are you doing? Like, can you, can you just click that subscribe button below? Like, just click the subscribe button below and press the bell next to it so that when i post a video you'll be the first to know <laughs> so from the topic today guys i'm sure you guys can already tell first of all my favorite thing of the week i'm sure it's quite obvious is my hair <laughs> shout out to my mommy <laughs> for the wheel shout out to you mommy you're the best <laughs> anyway guys like today we're going to be talking about our own basic and if you are not your balance okay. it is somewhere below basically debtors so last week i was watching one of token Makuma's videos that i'm sure she posted like a while back and she was talking about the same topic debtors and you know like as she was just saying it was like she was speaking my mind i'm just like i need to talk about this on my channel like more people need to know that you cannot be borrow borrowing like and they're just certain behaviors first of all like you all know how some people are just quick to call you up and ask like oh can i have 5k can you sharply borrow me 10k oh i'm in the middle of something now i'm stranded i'm this i'm that borrow me 2k borrow me 5k it's almost like oh okay 2k i mean uh -uh, haba or like 5k okay and the person be like just sharply borrow me the ones that ask for 10k are just the worst because i'm just looking at you like you must really think i'm rich <laughs> I'm not rich like that. Don't be calling me to ask me to borrow you. Thank you. If you give me self, I'll collect it. But you know, there are just some people that are like, okay, thank you. And the person is like, ah, I'll pay you back tomorrow. Some, 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 something. And when they are begging you, they are like the most humble people on earth. Even though there are some of them that are asking a very proud man. Now we're going to talk about those ones later. It's okay. Like we all have like those moments where we are cash trapped and we just need like help. And it's always nice to know that there's someone you have that friend you have that person that you can always call and sometimes it's actually nice to be the person that gets called because it just means that i don't i don't know what it means though please don't call me <laughs> let's let's cancel that cancelled <laughs> but you know like it's just nice to know that people feel like they can rely on you sometimes and which is all right you know like it's all right to ask for a bailout if you are it's all right as long as you have a payment plan see the people that are annoying me hmm? are the ones that ask rudely they're like um hello babe so like i need thank you now but sharply send it i'm like did you keep money with me <laughs> like is there was there a credit to my account that i'm not aware of which one is sharply send this you will even first ask me if i have to before you start telling me to sharply send see those ones like they really get on my nerve why the hell will you be trying to borrow money from somebody and you're like, hey, sharply send this? People around you will not think no. Like, the person is your accountant or financial manager or something. Like, stop that. That's bad behavior, okay? The second set of people that are annoying me are the ones that, oh, when they're asking, they're like really humble. They're like, oh, babe, um, this, the fact they will explain their whole life is true to you. So they're like, babe, I'm really trapped. Some, some, something. Um, I'm in the middle of an embarrassing situation. Like, can you just sharply help me out with like 5K? I'll pay you back tomorrow. You're like, oh, okay, okay. You start to feel sorry for them and you borrow them the money. Tomorrow, they won't even call you. Then, you are there. You need your 5K. You can't get it. For example, for someone like me, like, I do not know how to call people to ask them, like, people that are owing me to ask them how far. Like, I don't know how to do it. So, I'd rather not just borrow you, honestly. And before, I used to be the person that would say that any money I can't dash you, I can't borrow you. But right now there's no money i can even dash you like before i dash people like 2k 5k i'm sorry but now with this present economic situation with worry being the one in charge and all i can't even dash you my 1k so if i borrow you 1k best believe i want my money back so some of them would be like you you don't they don't call you 
a week runs by two weeks and then you call them first of all some of them will ignore your calls they won't pick up those are the annoying ones some of them will pick up and just start talking about something entirely different you'll be like ah so babe what's up blah 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 and you're there like fam like why aren't you talking about my money <laughs> you owe me money and then you won't like know how to bring it up and then for me just, i just get to a point where i'm like babe please how far my money they'll be like oh i'm so sorry i didn't get it um the money i was expecting didn't come mm, you, you all know those excuses me i'm just like okay so when am i getting my money and they'll be like eh, i promise i promise i'll get to you before the end of the week week will end they'll still not call you like those ones are just annoying anyway now i'm going to be talking about like certain things that you should not be found doing like i should not even catch you doing these things if you are a cereal or need me say if you are a boroboro make me shine there are certain things you should not be doing first of all like Toke said i copied this point from Toke's blog you should not be adding weights please why are you, where are you adding weights to like so you have money to eat but you cannot pay me my 5k back is that so Eh, those ones are not so that's like the bottom of the list. Then there are the ones that their Snapchat will be popping or their Instagram will be popping. They'll be going to all the nice places in Lagos to hang out and eat. Eh <laughs> oh so that's how it is. Eh oh so you can afford to go to Sheraton to have lunch, but you can't pay me the 10k you owe me. Excuse me, Oga, give me my money. Uh-uh, what's that? Eh, those ones, those ones are just very, very rude. Cause you know you are owing people money, and then you are having a good time, enjoying your life. You are even putting it on social media for us to see. Why are you trying to pepe? No, why are you doing pepe them gang for? Are you okay? You can't be. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me, guys. You can't be okay. You definitely cannot be okay. Then they are the ones that are just rude. The ones that when you call them to ask them for your money, they're like, ah, is it not just two k? Is that why you are harassing me? Are you okay? no excuse me like are you okay it's just 2k but you could borrow it it was important enough for you to call me to ask me for it but now i want my money back and it's not important enough for me to call you to ask me for it. can you just give me my money can, like can you borrow yourself sense <laughs> then they are the ones that live better lives than their creditor so you borrow 350k from somebody but you're driving range you have money to fill your car and the person that you borrowed money from is driving toyota corolla you are very rude. You are very, very, very rude. Borrow yourself sense, or okay? Like, don't be rude. Haba. <laughs> then they are the ones, there are certain things you should not be doing. Like buying new clothes and new shoes. Like some of them will even do it in your presence. Some of them can call you and be like, ah, babe, I want to sharply go to um, Palms. I want to go to the Hugo Boss store. I need to buy some things, please. They will even ask you for free ride. Ah, those ones are the worst. The ones that ask you for free ride to go and spend money. They'll be like, ah, please, babe, can you just sharply drop me at Palms? I want to go and buy some things from Hugo Boss. Eh, excuse me. Me that have car, do I have Hugo Boss? Do I have Hugo Boss? <laughs> Please, people should stop all this bad behavior, okay? If you're going to borrow money from someone, make sure that you have a payment plan. And just, like, and avoid borrowing as much as you can. Like, live within your means, okay? Live within your means so you don't have to borrow. And you don't have to be forcefully humble. Because if you're a borrower, you have to be humble. Let me just tell you now. So, <laughs> that's all we're going to be talking about today, guys. Ah! Pause for the beauty now back <laughs> so don't forget to like subscribe and don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video share the video with all your friends you know if there's someone that is owing you money and person has one of these bad behaviors just sharply send the person the link like subtle throw low key shade at the person <laughs> anyway thanks guys you guys are awesome fantastic i can't wait to catch you guys on my next video bye guys Mwah. and don't forget what will jesus do is jesus First of all, Jesus will not borrow <laughs> to start with. Jesus is not an unique base. So try to be like Jesus and stop borrowing yes. money. Like, apart from the fact that Jesus doesn't borrow money, Jesus is humble. Be humble like the Lord Jesus Christ. Okay? Bye, guys. Mwah.